Hi, boo. Hey, welcome to or welcome back to your girl's channel. Now, today's video, y'all, I, I can't even tell you fully what this one is about. Something about the boyfriend was trying to cheat with the mama, uh, something like that. I just know that homegirl is devastated, okay? So, let's get into it. Yeah, so I just followed my boyfriend to Sex Fifth Avenue. And, y'all, he cannot be trusted at all. And what I mean, he can't be trusted because. Now, I don't know too much about high-end retail stores, but I do know Sex Fifth Avenue is a Caucasian store. So, what, what hit black ass doing up in there? What, what, what y'all doing up in there? What the hell? My mama, she was transitioning. She was transitioning, and he knew that she left money for me, so he stayed... He stayed around for as long as he could just to get my mama life insurance money. I checked my bank account. I checked my bank account, y'all. It was $10,000 missing about the account. So I checked his location. He said he was at Baker's Market. So I'm waiting on him to come out, y'all. Because this is just so sick. This is sick. I can't believe he would do something like this. <laughs> See, this is how you know I don't be watching my full videos by myself. I wait to watch him with y'all. Because I got this whole story mixed up. Apparently, the mama is deceased. So the money that her mama left for her after her passing, he out spending it. Okay, got it together, y'all. My bad, boo. Okay, out of me, this Marcus. What I tell y'all? This is ridiculous. He said, this. Why would you steal $10,000? What the hell he got on? Why do y'all dress like this? Y'all dress like this because it's a name brand. Because it costs a lot. That don't make it look good. Y'all see this pretty cute little top I got on? Y'all know how much it costs? Like six, seven dollars. Stop playing with me. Y'all be out here cutting up good with other people money at that looking a fool in these stupid ass clothes out of life insurance i didn't touch the life insurance money yes you did i didn't, I didn't do that yes you did look at the you follow me i can see you wearing the life insurance money anytime a pair of shoes or jeans look extra dumb like that i know they was expensive and only black people dumb enough to go purchase that stupid stuff you don't see white people wearing shit like that you don't Really? Are you serious? You gonna do this to me? Ten thousand dollars. Ten thousand dollars came out, came up missing out of my account. You know I would never do nothing like that. Come on, get that camera. Look at you. Look what you got on. You got on Balenciagas. It's eighty degrees outside. You bought Balenciagas. What you get? Why did you follow me? You stole ten thousand. Times you cheated on me, man. That I have nothing to do with stealing from me. Now, if we talking about cheating, we could talk about cheating. But trying to use my cheating to justify your stealing, it's two different total things. And I can't stand man that dress like him. By the way, them skinny jeans and stuff. Grow the hell up. Get a pair that fit. He's scandalous as hell for doing that. And women, watch out for men like him. They literally only stick around because you got the money. You can't tell them that your mama. Don't be telling these men what was left to you. Don't be telling these men how much money you got. Best believe they be keeping stuff from you too. Child, if I ain't married to you, you won't know a damn thing about what's going on in my pockets. What do with stealing from me? You stealing money that my mama left me. You been following me, man. How you, you, how you get up here? What you mean? I drove. I followed you. I got a whole tag on your on the car. Yeah, come on now. Come on now. Can you pick that back up? Hey, Cause you, you about to. Why would I? I didn't. Come on, man. I didn't try to do that to you. You got the money out in cash. Like oh. why, why would you do that? You took Get away from me. That's why you wanted to stick a lot, stick around for so long. Cause you knew. Cause you money. knew it was money coming. You took the money. You agreed to take the money out in cash. No, I'm done. It's fire? over. Because why would you do this to me? You stole. You stole from me. All them times you cheated on me, though. What does cheating have to do with anything about stealing? At the end of the day, you took me back, but I can't take you back for I'm this. Sorry. No, you stole. 
You stole money from me that my mother left me. Get the bag up. We fin you finna take that back. I finna take that back. You about to take that back. First of all, I'm highly upset about the top of his head. That little clear spot that we can see above the blur. You done took $10,000 of this woman's money. Walking out of Neiman Marcus with Balenciaga's on and your skinny jeans looking dumb as hell. And you didn't think to go get your hair retwisted? Retwisted, cut, any damn thing. I don't know what's going on on top of that mop. I don't. It just looked like a bunch of bush. You should have took a hundred of them dollars and got your hair retwisted or something. Because you look a whole mess from the Balenciagas up. I'll make it up to you. Please, just give me one more chance. One more chance. All the times you cheated on me, it's payback. You follow me up for like... He said, all the times you cheated on me, this is payback. Men, do y'all agree with that statement? Hmm? Women, how do y'all feel about that statement? Are they even now? Is it is it all fair? Huh? She cheated, so I'm gonna I'm rob you, B. Toxicity at its finest. Girl, take the rest of your change and run. And definitely don't have no baby with this fool. Lord, don't have no baby with this fool. Me up here like what you you doing all this over some money i'm trying to look good and look fresh for instagram and you you come on man. are you serious you had your time to with shop. my with my all mama time life time insurance I'm money just, babe, I'm, look, I'm sorry for what i did with my mom life insurance money i gotta turn up though for the grand please get on my face because i'm trying my hardest i got mace in my hand I got mace in my hand ready to mace you. You got mace in your hand? Yes. Please go. I'm gonna leave. Don't Please go. I just, I just, I just wanted. You follow me. You pull up and follow me though. I was so with that. I just wanted the people to know how bad of a person you are. He grimy. He better be glad as hell that she didn't shh off in his ass. Okay? I know she had mace. That was kind of funny. <laughs> Y'all be taking us there. Y'all be making us mad, okay? Then it makes you and your Balenciagas. So he made it clear that, you know, this is payback. And he got a stunt for the gram. This is what y'all out here spending all y'all rent money on. Stunting for the gram. I know it's easier for the woman to say this because a woman can be fresh to death. Literally fresh to death. From her head to her toe and wearing a whole, what, $20, $40 outfit. Man, it takes y'all a little bit more. I get that, but... You better get your bum ass a job and spend it off of your own paycheck. Okay? That was supposed to be money put up for her future. And it's gone on your feet. And they got the nerve to be ugly as hell. That ticks me off ten times more. The stuff y'all be buying be stupid, ugly, nonsense. Out here looking like a, uh, with them tight ass pants on. Y'all want to be so about the gram. Show people who you really are sometimes. You can wear a normal pair of Nikes and still look good, boo. Y'all really be out here trying to impress people that don't give a dang about you. These people could care less if you was put in the dirt today. Their lives would go on tomorrow. I promise you it would. Do the right thing while you have the chance to. Invest your money wisely, y'all. These clothes and stuff, you ain't gonna be able to keep up with forever. I promise you, it is money down the drain when you really think about it. All these purses and bull crap y'all be buying, you can't take it with you. You cannot take it with you. So spend your money doing things that actually make you happy. You know, going places, traveling, doing things that are memorable. Not a pair of Balenciagas that she gonna be cutting up the moment you make her mad. <laughs> and that's what I feel about it. I do, I do, I do, okay? If you like this video, give your girl a like. Don't forget to subscribe, and I hope to catch you in the next one, boo.